Hi, this is Tim from the Stormgate team with an exciting development update. Our team has recently finished the milestone that we call Elephant, and we shared that externally at NextFest, and we had a lot of people able to play it. And through that phase, we've been overwhelmed with the amount of positive feedback and information and just dialogue with the community about the game and how it's shaping up. The information received is dramatically helping us to make the game a better game. And we couldn't be more appreciative to everyone who participated and who's engaged with us during this phase. We're hard at work now on the next milestone release, which is codenamed Frigate. Frigate is our upcoming release where we will be sharing for the first time ever a work in progress sneak peek version of our third faction. I'm not gonna give any spoilers now, but it has a lot of exciting new mechanics, new gameplay involved with it, and we're really eager to get it in your hands. In addition, we have a bunch of other really exciting changes in store, and I'd like to give you a glimpse of what we've been working so hard on. First up, creep camps have been reworked into capture points. Capture point contested. Players are able to maintain control over resource camps to receive passive benefits. And there's a new energy camp where you can restore your unit's energy. Capture point icons have also been updated and team colors now display on the mini map as well as in the game space. Matchmaking has also been updated to use a randomized map pool. We have two new maps that are being introduced in Frigate, starting with Lost Hope, which features four starting positions and random spawn locations in versus games. Another new versus map, Isle of Dread. This map represents our first steps into water mechanics in Stormgate. Right now, there is shallow and deep water, each with their own pathing. The water material also has some automated shoreline waves and underwater caustic effects. This terrain feature is going to undergo ongoing development and be expanded more in the future. And with this water feature and the code name Frigate, I just want to be clear, we're not including naval units directly in Stormgate, but we have developed our editor and this terrain feature with an eye towards the community being able to support this in the future. So I can't wait to get it in your hands and see what mod makers do with naval units in the future. We're also including a new three player co-op map called Abyssal Gates. In this map, you must stop the Lord of the Abyss from entering our world by destroying his five abyssal gates. The skies will blacken you with birds of metal. There are also a handful of experimental maps added for custom lobbies. This includes some two versus two maps for the first time. We'd love to get your feedback on them. For the Infernals, we're excited to showcase the Shadow Flyer unit model and animations, which have been updated in Frigate. Shadowflyer gameplay has also been adjusted to be less volatile. Its explosion now applies a stacking armor debuff that makes air units vulnerable to attacks for a short time. We've also just added a new unit, the Hexen, a tier one infernal caster. In versus games, the Hexen is the infernal's free starting unit. I shall go. As part of this, the infest mechanic has been removed from the gaunt and the Hexen steps in to apply Infest in a much more controlled manner with its abilities. First up, Skull of Shedda, a multi-purpose spell that allows players to scout the map and apply single target Infest. Venom Trap, use this to place concealed mines that apply AOE damage and Infest. Miasma, channel a zone control AOE ability that boosts Infest damage over time. For Vanguard, the EXO is being reimagined. During development, the EXO has evolved from a basic gunner to becoming a more powerful tier 1.5 unit. So the EXO's appearance is due for an upgrade to better match its new power levels. The EXO will have a more pronounced exoskeleton, a higher tech feel, as well as a larger reinforced arm to hold its powerful weapon. The new EXO model isn't quite ready for game time yet, but we're excited to share our progress on it. On the sound front, we've been recording a ton of new sound effects and voiceover lines. Here are a few samples. Waiting on you. Walking tall. Spray and pray. This round's on me. Watch out. I'm coming. Belly down. Where's the action? Undeploy it. Dig it in. Speak up. Standing up. Let's get to it. I'll be subtle. I'm good at subtle. Taking position. High speed pass. Get me in there. Listen, I come from a long line.
line of pilots. Uh, hot air balloon pilots, mostly. Out of our way. Run them down. Passeus as you. The strand is spun. Patience. I am still. So shifting gears and looking ahead to the future. This team is working really, really hard to deliver the best possible RTS game experience for you. And I want to say thank you for you being a part of this journey with us. Your feedback has already helped shape Stormgate and make it a better game than it would have been without you being a part of it. I'm excited to be able to share more with you as we move ahead. There are a lot of aspects of the game that we haven't been able to talk about just yet. And I'm looking forward to being able to peel back the curtains on development and share some of these super secret things with you. In particular, we've been hard at work on the campaigns and some other aspects of the game that uh, we've made great progress on and we'll be talking more in the future. Uh, and I'm super excited about. I'd like to end on a note of gratitude for you, the community whether you have participated in the Kickstarter or uh, or NextFest or have been a part of any of our play tests or our online communities, your presence and your engagement with us makes a huge difference. We could not be doing what we're doing without you. And literally this game would not be in existence now if it were not for the support of you. So thank you very much from the bottom of our hearts for everybody at Frost Giant. Uh, we really appreciate you and we can't wait to share the next steps of this journey with you and see where it goes. Yeah.